everyone. So in this DIY truffle chocolate kit, it's really special because you also have a 12-year-old double cast de Macallan bottle and three recipes to pair really well to enjoy it with de Macallan double cast. Now, in this hamper kit, you have 300 grams of milk chocolate, 150 grams of dark chocolate, one liter of cream, 10 grams of Milo powder, 10 grams of coffee powder, one old grey tea pouch, one bottle of popping candy, and a bottle of cocoa powder, and also you and a box of five chocolate that is specially curated to enjoy with the Macallan double cast 12 years old. What you will need is a pot, a spatula, a whisk, and a bowl. If you're doing all three recipes, you will need three bowls, three pots, three spatulas. Okay, so let's start cooking. So the first recipe we'll make is Milo truffles. Okay, so first, weigh out your cream. So what we'll do is bring your cream to a boil. Now you want to pour this Milo powder into the cream. Now using a whisk, gently mix it very well together. Now you mix it until it's really well incorporated. Now when it's brought to a boil, you want to pour that into 150 grams of the milk chocolate. Now you want to let the hot cream sit in there and melt the chocolate. Now give it a stir until it's really well incorporated. So for the second recipe, we're going to be making kopi truffles. Now this also pairs really well with the 12 year old double cast. Now first uh, weigh out 75 grams of cream again, bring it to a boil. We have also weighed out the coffee powder for you. Now just add that into the cream. Take a whisk and whisk it really well together. Make sure it's brought to a boil. It takes about 30 seconds to boil. Now you want to get ready 150 grams of dark chocolate. And then I'm going to pour it into the dark chocolate. Now using a spatula to gently mix it well together. So for the third recipe, we're actually going to be doing a tea chocolate. Now we've actually included old grey tea as well and if you really like this recipe, you can also take other types of tea and make uh, you know, tea chocolates with this recipe. So first, take your tea bag and infuse it into the cream. Weigh out 75 grams of cream and 150 grams of milk chocolate. Now I'm going to put my tea bag into the cream. Now you want to infuse all that flavour in. And I'm going to let it gently simmer. Now I'm going to bring it back to a boil. Then I will pour it into 150 grams of milk chocolate. I will mix it really well together. Now you get ready a Tupperware like this. And you can put a piece of paper below so that it's easy to actually take out the chocolate later. We're going to set the chocolates into a Tupperware. Now my container is like the size of my palm. Now a tip for you is before I set this into the fridge, I put a layer of cling wrap touching the surface of the chocolate. So I've poured all three of my chocolate ganache into the containers. And uh, I have three containers of ganache right now. Now what I do is I'm going to put them into the fridge. So the chocolates are out of the fridge and uh, we, I set it for at least about 4 hours in the fridge. If you want it faster, you can set it straight into the freezer. Now in the freezer, it's about 1-2 to two hours. So once it's set in the fridge, take it out and then cut it really nicely into cubes. Now we've also included these popping candies so that you can enjoy it together with the chocolates. They're really fun and it's always a nice surprise. And have your cocoa powder ready in a bowl. Now I'm going to just coat them with cocoa powder and also dust it. If you have some spare Milo at home, you can dust it with Milo powder as well. You can also roll them into truffles, um, round little truffles. And actually that's quite simple as well. You get these really nice balls. I've also got my kopi chocolates. What I did was I sprinkled some of these pop rocks on top of the kopi chocolates and uh, dusted it with cocoa. Now just be very careful and quick. Uh, when you're garnishing it with the pop rocks, it's meant to be eaten almost immediately uh, because you know the popping candy is sugar and uh, basically it will turn quite uh, soft after a while. So now I'm just gonna display my chocolates all ready to enjoy it together with the Macallan Double Cast 12 years old. I'm pouring a shot for myself. So I've got my three chocolates ready. I've got my Milo chocolates, my coffee chocolates with pop rocks, 
and also my tea chocolate. So I'm just going to enjoy this with my family and friends and take a sip of this Macallan. So good. And a bite of the chocolate for sure. It goes really well. Um, I hope you had fun with me in this session and wishing all fathers out there Happy Father's Day. If you enjoyed this session, all items are also available on bakeathome.online and you can find lots of recipes also on my Instagram. So I look forward to see you soon. Cheers!